The bully coot are also called the beast from the east. It's extremely huge, big boned and muscular dog breed and this video will be all about bully kutas. Quick quiz before the video, which is the most common color of Bully Kuta's coat? A. Black B. Brindle C. White Watch the video and find out the correct answer. Bully Kutas are strong, big bone dogs with sturdy physique. Bully Kuta males weigh anywhere between 65 to 80 kilograms, although there are some extraordinary big males that can be as heavy as 90 kilograms. The height of male bully kuta range from 75 to 110 centimeters while females are logically a little bit smaller, they, their height range from 70 to 90 centimeters. This breed has soft, short and a non curly coat. Most bully kuta dogs are white in color but it is common to find them in black, red, white and brown, white and black, harlequin, brindle and fawn colors. This breed is oftentimes characterized by very big head, black colored muzzle and loose hanging lips that drool all day long. This breed is not only huge in size, they also have very dominant nature, temperament. That is the reason why new dog owners are not advised to start their dog experience with the Bully Kuta dog breed. Also, this breed requires a large space and doesn't do well in apartments. Moreover, they are not only very powerful dogs, they also have powerful sense of smell and sight which makes them excellent guard dogs. Actually, they are not only protective of their own space, but also tend to protect their owners and their assets. But a bully kuta puppy requires a lot of time training socialization before they develop the special bond with their owners. Outside the India this breed is very rare, but inside the India not so much. And if I talk, if I ask some Indians who own bully kudas or see bully kudas every day on their opinion about this dog breed, I got very different opinions. Some of them are saying that this is extremely aggressive mastiff dog and that they are dangerous for both owners and strangers. Others will say that these dogs are generally super friendly to people. The truth will be somewhere in the middle and it will really depend on the training and the socialization. But one thing is 100% sure, Bully Kudas are fearless natural guards, excellent guards and they will definitely alert you when something suspicious is going on around your property, when some strangers are there or even some stray stranger dogs, because Bully Kudas normally don't like other dogs very much. Multiple theories try to explain the origin of this breed's name. However, there is a high probability that this breed's name was coined from the word bowly, which means extremely wrinkled. And indeed, this dog breed has loose wrinkly skin, particularly all over the neck and below the chin. Additionally, this breed's name includes the word kuta, meaning dog. The original breeders of Bully Kutas didn't leave much documentation and that is why there are a lot of theories and arguments about the breed's origin. The most objective and widely accepted is that this breed is from ancient Pakistan or India. Many people believe that the Bully Kuta is a crossbreed between the molosser breeds such as the Allhound or the Saint Hound owing to its striking resemblance to these two breeds. There is also another theory that explained that when British invaded India, the British troops moved to the country with their English Mastiffs. Consequently, English Mastiffs bred with the Indian Mastiffs, resulting in the Bully Kuta breed. The Bully Kutas are considered very healthy breed, especially for a Mastiff type of dog, but of course with age there are some health problems just like with any other dog breed like blindness or arthritis. 
Unlike other dog breeds, the Bully Kuta requires minimal grooming. The breed has a short coat and it sheds a moderate amount of hair. Their coat, if you want to keep the coat in a good shape, you should brush them occasionally with soft, slicker brush. Bully Kutas need some daily exercise in order to stay in shape. These exercises are not only beneficial because of their mental and physical health, but also because they keep the dog busy and help to tame inappropriate behavior. Behavior. The Bully Kuta is very powerful and dominant dog and it's only recommended for experienced dog owners. Tell me in comments what is your opinion about Bully Kutas. And if you are new on this channel, consider subscribing, turn the notifications on and check our Facebook, Instagram, links are in description. Thank you for watching, see you in the next video.